Hello, faith leader, and welcome to Break Time. Today, Psalm 1820 says, The Lord has dealt with me according to my righteousness. According to the cleanness, cleanliness of my hands, he has rewarded me. Oh, you know, I'm David had this rich relationship with God. He understood God's grace. He understood God's mercy. He understood God's forgiveness. He knew that God didn't treat him as his sins deserved, but God treated him with grace mercy, the righteousness that God had given to him. Here's what's really cool. Christ has given us righteousness. He has given it into us. He's in, the word is imputed. It means he's put his rightness in you and in me. And so we are not treated as our sins deserve, but because of Christ's rightness living in us, we're rewarded out of that reward because of Jesus Christ. So we owe it all. You know, I love that song. I owe it all to Jesus because he's paid it all for me. You know, that I'm blessed because of him. I'm re You're rewarded because of him. I'm rewarded because of him. You know, it's not because we are right in and of ourselves. Have you ever tried to live in a right way apart from Christ? You know, in, in, where you try to gather all your strength in to do everything the right way and but didn't understand the, the mercies of God that was there to walk beside you. And so even as I'm talking this out, my mind is just spinning because it's like I, I want to be that person who says Christ rightness righteousness lives within me in such a way that that's my reward. That's, I've been rewarded because of that, because his acts are in me, him living in me and through me in such a way that, that God is pleased with me. He's pleased with me because Jesus lives within me. He loves me dearly and he loves you dearly. He calls us his own. He calls us his children. He calls us his witness and his ambassador and all those other wonderful names, but you are his bought with a price of the cross of Jesus Christ in such a way that now his righteousness lives within you. What a, what a reward is waiting for us. And so I want to be, I want to align myself with the rightness that God has already provided for me. I don't want to recreate it. I don't want to try to do it. He's not recreating Sabra. Nope. He's put Christ in me. And now I align myself with Christ and his riches. Oh, so yeah, that's, that's a difficult thing to do because in our minds, most of the time we want to figure it out. We want to, we want to be right. Nope. It's Jesus rightness living within us. Align yourself with that rightness. Align yourself with that because it's in there. And you, my friend, 